Hello children. In this lesson we are going to learn how to find the sum of exterior angles of a polygon. Let's revise what we have learned in our previous lesson. We learned about sum of interior angles of a polygon. A triangle, we know the sum of interior angle is 180 degree. Sum of this angle plus this angle plus this angle. For a quadrilateral, it is 360 degrees. Sum of this angle plus this plus this plus this. And the generic formula we learned for the sum of interior angle was if there is a polygon of sides, number of sides as n, then it will have n minus 2 triangles if we draw diagonals from a given point and sum of its interior angle will be n minus 2 triangles into sum of interior angle of each triangle which is 180 degree. So sum of interior angles of a polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree assuming n is equal to number of sides. So say there is a quadrilateral here we draw a diagonal from this point it divides this quadrilateral into two triangles and sum of interior angles is replace n by 4 4 number of sides 1 2 3 4 4 minus 2 is number of triangles 2 into 180 degrees is the sum of interior angle of each triangle 2 into 180 degrees 360 degree so sum of interior angle of a quadrilateral is 360 degree now in this lesson let's learn about what is the sum of exterior angle? Here is a pentagon given. Here are all its exterior angles. You know this is this is interior angle and this is exterior angle. If you extend a side and you see what is the outside angle which is this angle or this is also an exterior angle, this is also an exterior angle, this is also an exterior angle, this is also an exterior angle. So let's try to find out what is the sum of exterior angle of a polygon. Let's say here is a pentagon shaped park and somebody is walking on the periphery or on the boundary of this park. So starting from this point the goal is to come back to this point while walking on the boundary. So I start from this point, keep walking. As soon as I hit this point I need to turn. I need to turn left if I'm walking this direction I'm going to turn left to start walking this side so I turn by an angle M and then I start walking here then as soon as I reach this point I again turn by an angle N this is the exterior angle and I start walking on this side then as soon as I reach this point I need to turn again to walk on this line I need to walk on the boundary right so I turn by angle P and I start walking on this side, this boundary of this pentagon shaped park. And I, as soon as I reach point E, I need to again turn by an angle exterior angle Q to start walking this way. And then when I reach point A, I again turn by an exterior angle R to start walking here till I reach my starting point where I started. So I walked on the boundary of this pentagon and as you can see I turned five times by an exterior angle M here to start walking here by an angle N to walk on this side by an angle P to walk on this side by an angle Q to walk on this side and by an angle R to come till here and if you observe carefully this is very similar to if suppose you are walking on a circular path right you are going to really go like this and finally you come back right and that angle you know is 360 degree right to to turn around completely like this this is exactly what you are doing here this angle plus this angle plus this angle plus this angle is finally leading you to the same point it's like a like a virtual circle if you think you are just going round the circle and you came back just think on this line perspective so what it really means is sum of all exterior angles of this pentagon is equal to 360 degree. And if you draw any polygon, you are going to do exactly the same thing. If even if you do hexagon or octagon, nonagon, you are going to do the same thing. So sum of all exterior angles of any polygon 
is equal to 360 degree because you really go around the path and come back to the same point. So this exterior angle plus this plus this plus this plus this is equal to 360 degree. That's all in this lesson children. Bye bye.